Stop washing your dirty linens in public. Tyler Perry angrily told Prince Harry and Meghan. Closed sources reports that Prince Harry and Meghan have subjected themselves to mere beggars in public, going from one place to another asking for help and support. The two have decided not to do anything productive to better their lives. Tyler Perry who happens to be the Sussexes' closest friend has tried talking to them on several occasions on how to make themselves financially independent and put an end to the shameful live they've been living. Harry and Meghan have never listened to Perry, instead, they turn to throw hurtful words on him telling him to stay away from them and that he should never interfere in their marriage. On hearing this, Tyler had to isolate himself from the Sussexes and cancelled all the deals he had with them. Also, Tyler Perry made Harry and Meghan to understand that, they have to submit themselves so people will genuinely help them instead of going around living fake lives and desiring what they can't afford. Lately, the two have been begging the owner of Montecito to give them a place so they could use it to show off. Meanwhile, Taylor Swift is said to have snubbed a personal letter from Meghan Markle, asking her to appear on her podcast, Archetypes. The hitmaker is believed to have received a handwritten note from the Duchess of Sussex. However, according to the Wall Street Journal, the 33-year-old singer did not take up her offer. The publication claims Taylor declined to take part through a representative. Express.co.uk has contacted a spokesperson for Taylor Swift for comment. The aforementioned newspaper went on to discuss Meghan and Prince Harry's careers since relocating to the US. They suggested that Archul employees claimed the company often lacked direction. An insider said that, at times, Harry and Meghan seem surprised by the work required to finish entertainment projects. It added, most potential initiatives, they said, follow a similar route, big idea, subpar execution. Harry, in particular, struggled to land on an idea, the publication added of the couple's Spotify deal. It comes just days after Spotify and Archual Audio announced they would be parting ways in a mutual decision. The former confirmed it was not renewing Archetypes, which ran for 12 episodes from August 2022. It was estimated that the contract was worth £18 million in late 2020. During its run, Meghan spoke to high-profile stars including Serena Williams and Maria Carey. It won the Top Podcast Award at the People's Choice Award in Los Angeles. The Wall Street Journal previously quoted an Archul spokeswoman as saying Megan is continuing to develop more content for the Archetypes audience on another platform. The collapse of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's Spotify deal sparked reports that Megan was not present for the celebrity one-on-ones, reported the Daily Express US. Bravo executive and podcast guest Andy Cohen told US Weekly, of course, I spoke with Megan, and she definitely interviewed me. That's an insane rumor. Her podcast is conversations with people, how would she not have? Of course, she did.